Just kill. Literally just kill. Go, go mode. Everybody's gonna be watching. So. I mean, I think for as a team, like we can be whatever we wanna be. Like I really think we can we can make it to the championship, we can win. I saw him after the season ended, he was a completely different player. He was a different person. I walked into the gym after I got hired and I said, who the hell is this kid? And it was Adrian Perez. So he went from someone who I didn't know where his path was to earning a varsity level. At that point, my message to you is this, everybody's journey is different. Whether you were here last year or you weren't, it doesn't matter to me. What I care about is are you better tonight and tomorrow than the last time I saw you. Whether it was last week, last month, or last February. Or I've never seen you before. That's what we care about. So don't bank on what you've done, it's about what you're going to do. This kid has earned everything he's got. When people ask you, what do you what's, describe your culture of your program, my answer would be Adrian Perez. He's earned everything he's got, and he's gonna continue to do that as we go along. Okay. Um, to finish that, one more thing that he has earned um, on behalf of the coaching staff, we want to announce that Adrian will be a captain. This season. My name is Adrian Perez. I'm a captain, uh, class 2024. To be honest, I was surprised because nobody told me, and I didn't think I was going to get it. Because, well, no, actually. No, yeah, I was just really surprised, and I was, I didn't know, I didn't have no clue, nobody told me nothing, but I'm glad I got it. From freshman year, I first got here, <clears throat> and I knew most of the people here, whatever. I made the freshman team, but I wasn't that good, I was a little big. Sophomore year came back, made JV, and, like, I didn't really play that much, but, like, I tried to have a role, but it just wasn't working out that much, and I knew I could get to a better, like, I wasn't at my highest, like, you know what I'm saying like highest limit. Then that summer <clears throat> came, worked, worked out, got slimmer, became better shooter, better dribbler, all that stuff. Came made varsity <clears throat> and got a couple minutes, you know what I'm saying, here and there. I was playing, getting buckets. And then in the summer league, that's when I really showed out, was scoring, doing everything, playing AAU, dropping 30, stuff like that, and now I'm here. Summer heading into eighth grade, I had like a crazy growth spurt and I became like 5'10. So, like, beginning of eighth grade, my brother was like, Now nah, we gotta use the height, like, you can be something. So, I was like, All right, so we started working out every day, every day, like outside in his own gym that he had, just hooping all day, every day, learning big, move, big boy moves and all that. So, that's basically how it all started. And then, high school, we even like before I went to high school, like the summer and into freshman year, worked hard, learned like some guards moves and all of that to because I became six one then. So then yeah, that's how basically all started.
something off of this to create something. Nah, I have my. Oh my god, nah, let me see you dunk it. Do it, scream it. Nah, do it. Wait, play do it. You better dunk it. <laughs> <laughs> nah, imagine. <laughs> we are going to be a great rebounding team. Okay. There is no reason, with our size and athleticism and length, that anybody should get an offensive rebound off of us over free throw. Okay. But at the same time, we're working our offensive rebounding because we have the size and length to tip it up and get second chances. Okay. This is going to be a big part of our. Our success. All right, that's why we're practicing. So, this is a one shot free throw. This is live. If white, you get the rebound. Yeah, see, see. It's over. Red, if you get it, white. Okay? Yeah, I see. I see. I see. Finally, sponsor us, bro. You see it right there? Hey. We really made it right here. Let's see. Saying. We made it. They finally sponsored us. That's what I'm saying. We made it. <laughs> now they're gonna put okay, my Jay. face on the can. So y'all yeah. know. Hey, Soak City. Soak City, come on now. Soak City. Yo, T.O. Hey guys. Hell no. This is a hater right here. Ready? Who's there next? That's Butter. That's Butter. Let's go. intention of quitting um, especially all my boys being on the team you know obviously it wasn't a great experience like watching it from the crowd but you know obviously that changed this year and you know putting in the hard work I used that as motivation was in the gym every single day and got so much better and, and got my confidence up a lot My name is Brendan Smith, class of 2024, Cranston West. So I know I'm on a team that does really well, our works really hard. I mean, I know I'm on a team that has a chance to do great things this year, and I'm just motivated to contribute to that. Just do my part, whatever Coach Sweeney asked me to do. Early game prediction for the half court shots. I got Kennedy. Kennedy's about to, about to make another half shot. I literally called it, bro. Oh, Don't ever kiss that. No. Yo, I'm your biggest fan. I'm your biggest fan. I 
he shoots so many of this. Sorry, oh, the under was so good. I am. If you remember last time we talked watching the Kobe video, pushing each other, right? You inadvertently push each other when you, with your focus and your work ethic, right? You're nine out of nine at the following line and you're sitting there saying, oh, I don't want to be the guy who misses, right? I mean, that's just reality, okay? When you check into the game, you don't want to be the guy that's not working as hard as your teammates, right? You don't want to be the guy that puts your team behind the eight ball because you're not diving on the floor, you're not closing out, you're not doing what you're supposed to be doing, okay? That is inadvertently pushing each other to be better. I'm Ethan Madden, I'm a junior here at Cranston West, I'm a guard. So, um, you transferred from Penn State, right? Yeah. So why, why was that? Why was you transferred? I mean, I've been in Cranston my whole life. I just felt out of place at Hendrickson. I feel like this was always my home. Came back here and I really knew when I got back here that this is where I was supposed to be. You're a big baseball guy. Um, how do you balance both sports out and which sport do you prefer? I mean, I love both. I mean, baseball's always been number one, but coming here at Cranston West, basketball's really, it, it made me love basketball a lot more. Like, I didn't realize how much I really liked basketball until I started playing here. Yeah, it was, it was different, because like, all these kids knew everybody. Like, I knew these kids, but it was like, wasn't close to them, because I wasn't here the first year. And, you know, making varsity, it took me a little bit to get used to it, because, you know, I didn't know those guys much, but they brought me in like family, and it was definitely the best move for me. For me, I just gotta play my role, like I know, I'm not like Jamie and I'm like Ryan, like Adrian, like they're, they're like the show. I just I just play defense, I do my job. What do you, besides you, what do you think is gonna hit the half court shot? Me? Besides you. Me? Me, myself, no. and I. I got, I, I, I got I Elijah got. today. Whoa. I got Elijah today. Whoa. To hit the half court shot. I'm telling you right now, oh. I'm, hitting, I'm hitting the one the first round, nobody's gonna hit it. And I'm telling you right now, it's either gonna be Big Stiff or Kennedy oh, today. I, I thought you were gonna say no, If he's not saying me, then it's definitely. I had Kennedy last time. I'm not gonna lie, it's probably, it's probably gonna be Kennedy like most practices. We're talking about winner call. Uh, <laughs> Everybody's over here talking about biddies, but. You like, should go with M. You really think about it, but you gotta go. You know who I'm going with? You wanna know who I'm going with? You gotta stay soft. Yeah, the bull. You feel me? Yo, we married to the game. We married to the game. We ain't going with nobody else. My points, I don't know. Because it'd be karma, right? I'd be saying that, and then I don't get the point, right? And then we get in that dub, boy. Big dub. This old game. Well, my name is Jamie Napante. Um, number 11 on the Cranston West basketball team. Yeah, you actually was. So I'm a small Go. forward. I play all positions. And it feels great, to be honest. I like, it feels great being a captain. Um, just, 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 just to have fun. It's always fun, you know. I'm always feel like I, I'm the bigger guy, so I like to boss around my teammates. But like, you know, they look up to me and stuff, so it's it just feels good. And coming to Cranston West is a great opportunity. I mean, the coaching staff is amazing. I've been with Coach Sweeney since I was in middle school, and he's always taken care of me. I've always been under his wing. He's always been a great coach for me, and I love him. All right. So after your senior year, where do you hope to go with basketball? To be honest, I don't know yet, but I want to play at any division level, hopefully D1 or D2, but I'll play anything. And I just want to continue on my legacy playing basketball. My heart right here. Okay. Hey, right here. Hey, I'm there! 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 I'm Effing ball <laughs> after we make the half court shot. You're running on Nick here. Come on, DB. We're in five. Oh! I told you, I told you. Oh! I told you. Oh! I told you. Oh! I told you. I told you. Let me hit two in a row. Why not? You're so annoying. You really called it up. We're 21 Another? Savage this time, boy. Another? 21. It's very exciting. Oh you look like shit. Right. We gotta, we gotta cut that. We're gonna talk where a ski mask doesn't warm us with the black ones off. <laughs> <laughs> I was kind of like 
you know, I didn't want to get him in the middle of the season, but once I heard December 1st, I knew we could have him. I was praying that we get him for, for Wednesday night and obviously for our game Thursday. So you guys earned this. It meant a lot to me to make sure you are the first team that gets to wear these. We're going to wear them for a long time because they cost a lot of money. Okay, but wear them with pride. You guys earn these things. You're going to look sexy as hell everywhere. That we go. <laughs> One of the events that you guys are going to participate in is we're going to do a three-point contest. Okay, three of you, we're going to do it at practice. Okay. Um, you're going to get 30 seconds at any spot you want, and whoever gets the most threes wins. So we're going to do this at practice to end practice tomorrow. Whoever the top three are, you'll compete on Thursday night, uh, Wednesday night at the event. You're going to go against the top three of the girls. Okay, oh, be, be <laughs> it's not, I shouldn't say you're going at this I shouldn't say you're... Media day is at 2 o'clock, so you can go home after practice, shower, look pretty. And uh, media day, guys, I'm going to be honest, it's going to be it's going to be a couple hours at least. Remember last year, Varsity guys, you're going to do the hype video, we're going to do all that stuff. Santos has got some crazy shit he wants to do, so we're all in. So it's going to be a, probably two to three hours, okay? Um, Sunday, we got practice in the morning, breakfast, and a PC game. So we got a hell of a week coming up. We want to look damn good. Proud of you guys. Let's have a great practice tomorrow. And uh, get your stuff, and I'll give you a uniform. Together, yes! three. One, two, three. Together. Quickly. Brendan's been doing it. Someone's throwing me a lob. I'm gonna I'll be like, you do that. Next play, I come down. Mm, and then, ready? We're gonna throw this clip and then switch it like that, and I'm gonna easily be that drone. Watch. Fast break. Oh, 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 Number one, man, you know the vibes? Big number 11. You already know. What's Kennedy? What, what number are you? What number? Three? Three. Trash. 11 right, You want to know why I'm 11? Because I'm one of one. <laughs> Tech corny. <laughs> I'm at my heart. I know you're mad at me. We still can't wear my jersey at the game. I don't care. Yeah. Like, then we're putting that. In the, we're putting that in the episode. She's gonna see this. And then watch. You're gonna clip it. Watch. Ready, DJ? She's gonna. You're gonna clip this and then put it to her wearing my jersey during the game. Watch. Shout out. Shout out my dude Nick Massey. Oh, what's up, dog? My arm I'm picking a charger because you know I'm bigger than that. I'll be like that. Mm. Hey, I'm bouncing off. Oh my God, hey, this half. No way, you got a small. No, no one got a small jersey. Yeah, it's a medium. No one got, got a small jersey. Yeah, it's small. Hold on. This is actually filled. Barry, you have to get posted up in it. Oh yeah, Larry, you got me on film, right? Larry, you got me on film, this is for you. Oh, I'm off. What's up, uh, Smitty? Oh, oh, Krimi! You gonna say something? Yeah, what's up? That's racist. Yeah, say something. Yeah, oh, you already know the vibes, number three in here. Nah, he's gonna cut it out. I already told him, I was like, if I swear, yo. Get ready for DTV, the play is DTV, get ready for it. Yo, Pess! What up, guys? Let's get this kid, go. What up, yo? It's me, Liam Perry. Nice to meet y'all. So he's gonna wait for the game to start. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Ryan Zarella, senior captain for Cranston West. Well, I wouldn't say I have pressure, but at some point in a close game, I'll pressure comes along, but being a leader, the floor general, that's what I love to do. Get my teammates the ball, especially Adrian, shout out. He can shoot, so give him the ball when I need him to shoot, and then we'll be good. Yeah, I've always been the point guard ever since growing up, since I played in Johnston, now in Cranston. Um, being a point guard just taught me just to be a leader on and off the court. Sometimes you got to be the bigger person even though you're not the tallest. I shouted this man out. I shouted you out in, the, in my interview. Say? I said, I give it to my shooter because I know he'll hit the shot. Word that. Hey, yo, we're holding up the one because... Yeah, yeah. I see where, like... This is Jordan Poole over here, bro. Look. Jordan Poole. Yo, you got to do a... Yo, yo, in the, bro, on the dock, you got to put a side-by-side. Him and Jordan Poole. I'm telling you. All you just needed... All you just needed is like this, bro. Jordan Poole. Don't take... 35, 40 seconds to walk out there. When your music plays, you can take your time. Don't be too crazy. We, we got to stay on some whatever timeline so we can get all this stuff done tonight. 
Everybody good, suited up, uniforms ready to go? Coaches will lead their team out. With the exception of myself and Coach Sweeney, every other coach will be there. Coaches will be first, followed by their team. Any questions? It's me. Let's go. Liv Tedeschi Moran. I mean, Olivia. <laughs> Olivia Ray Tedeschi Moran. Olivia. Yeah, yeah, that shit was. Some dog one. It was good. I'm DJ. Uh, I'm a senior guard at Cranston West, and I play for the basketball team. Obviously, I'm in this documentary. So, I would say I was kind of inspired by my dad, because, like, my dad played his whole life, and then, you know, he kind of always had, like, you know, like, the little rubber bouncy balls. He always had one in my hands, so, like, I would always play in the little tykes hoops. And then, uh, then finally, they bought me a hoop and put it in my driveway, and that's when I really started taking it serious, and I really wanted to go far with basketball. Me and my parents came to an agreement because I wanted to play high school basketball for my senior year. And um, I, don't, I don't think, I think I have a better opportunity playing here than I did there. So um, yeah, but the transition was pretty much smooth other than, I, you know, I miss my guys from EP. I grew up with them and played basketball with them my whole life. So I do miss them, but the coaches and my teammates here really did, you know, welcome me into the basketball family here that they got. So I feel, you know, I feel like I'm at home over here. Yo, get this on, get this on, get that on camera, please. Get that on camera. Get that on camera. Oh Are we serious, Kennedy? A simp's gonna simp. Are we serious? Choo choo! It's snowing, Kennedy! Oh my lord, look at this. I didn't know there was snow in the fork. Welcome to the nest for tonight's second annual Falcon Basketball Tip Off event. Head coach Bobby Santos, assistant coach of When the next thing we're gonna do is we have CLCF Travelers here, they're gonna play a game, okay? We are gonna do exactly what we just did for you, for them, okay? We're gonna have them come out of the balloon arch from in here, and you guys are gonna be the ones who are lined up, you and the girls program. Chair for them, Dapping them pop on, future Falcons, so they can replace you when you guys are out of here. That's All right? Sick. Hey, have a great night, have fun. Let's go, baby. Right? Yeah. All right, we're gonna... So that started by one and then boom. All right, All right. just All give right. us right. something. So let's go, let's go. go. What? It don't matter. It really don't matter. That's how you handle everything, bro. Yeah. <laughs> he like broke his leg when he lost the game, and then it was like back in, in place the next day. Yeah. 
Is it my buddy and that's Alessandro's brother? Yeah, 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 Sophia is here! Kayla Bake is here! Kayla Bake is here! And this is not four! Jesus Christ! Hey! Hey! You just you gotta compete with her! She's butter! Kyla! Yeah, whoa! Hold up, sweetie! Hold up! Hold up! Hold up! Hold up! They got six basketballs! We're only using one. I know, but we're waiting, we're waiting. We're getting more, we're getting more. All right. Let's go. Elijah, I need one. Two. Uh, Kyla's bucket. Kyla's bucket, so I don't know how we're going to... Yeah, here we go. Come on, Rob. Oh my gosh. How is she? Oh, come on, Rob. Come on, Rob. Come on, Rob. Yeah. Come on, Rob. 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 I have seven. I hit. I hit one. They didn't say it. Yeah, seven. I I hit one. I hit one. Seven. Yeah. It was fun. This year's gonna be even funner. I'm a senior now, so it's the last time. Gotta enjoy it. I got you. Wait when you come back. Right. That's how we run. This kid never got in the way. Give it up. Adrian. Yeah, Adrian, you're, you're uh, uh, Nick. Shoot it. Ken, right there, shoot that. Yo, Ken, Kennedy. Ken, Ken, say something in the mic. Say something. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, boy, let's go. Go corner, far corner. Far corner. Go. Yo, from the, right there. Yo. Yo, Ken. Yo, this kid is cut. Go, go. Jay. That's what we're trying to do. 
We're gonna try doing that. Right here, let's go. Ken, Ken, Ken. Kennedy, let's go. Right here, right. Watch out, watch out, watch out. Watch out, Smitty. Wanna just no, wanna just all go out there? Wanna just all go out? Yo, let's just all go out. Let's just all go out. Yo, let's all go. Hey! I'm shooting the half court shot. Yeah, I'm shooting the half court shot. Come here, Jay. I'm shooting, I'm shooting, I'm shooting. That's all. Hey, yo, what, yo, what are we doing? You think it was calm? It was valid. I'm hungry as hell. I'm trying to get some food. I'm trying to get some snacks. Yeah. Kennedy, bro, why you miss so many guns? What? Yo, we had to put on a show for the fans. You know what I'm saying? Alright, so just to review some of the stuff that we talked about yesterday, okay? Uh, focusing on Preet. Uh, Jamie and you got him. He's a shooter. We got to force him back to the basket, run him off the foul line, uh, run him off the three-point line. Vince is the big. Kennedy's got him. Lennox is the point guard. rye has got him, and Rodriguez is the second shooter. Ethan's got him to start. AP will take whoever's not, um, whoever's off that off guard. Okay. It gets a little chaotic. It's the first game, first night. Things might be ugly to start. Your first might jumper might be ugly. You might take a layup. Regardless, you gotta keep playing. The mentality's gotta be to keep. Going, and those guys upstairs, our guys are doing a phenomenal job of just battling through mistakes, and it's earning them. That's what they they want to track me. They want to force us into bad decisions and then capitalize off of it. But when to attack, bait the guard, dish it off. When to kick, when to shoot. Okay, trust your decision making. Irregardless of what happens, get back on defense. If we stop them on transition defense, force them into a half court, and run off the, their shooters off the line, we're going to have success defensively. Control the pace of the game. Control the glass. Win the paint. Physical game going on upstairs. Kind of a little undisciplined. There's a ton of fouls. I, don't, I have no idea who these two officials are. Never seen them in my life. And that's fine. I'd rather have that. Okay? Play through the officiating. I don't want to hear it. Strong, professional body language. I will cover you. Go and play every single possession. Be physical on your box outs. Be in control when they trap you. Rip it through. Get on the floor. Control loose balls. Everything is ours. And the last thing, guys, excel in your role, okay? We have a design rotation tonight based on what we've seen for the first week and a half, okay? You're going to get opportunities. Excel in what we're asking you to do tonight. Just focus on the time you have. If it's 30 seconds, make it the best 30 seconds you can make it tonight. Whatever we're asking from you, master it. Be the best at it. Focus on now. What happened at practice last night, what's going to happen at practice on Saturday means nothing. Have fun. We have a lot of seniors, a lot of guys with experience. Go play. Go play. It's a non-league game to get us prepped. Okay, you should be loose. And I get we're all going to have nerves. I have nerves. It's the first game. Just go play and have fun and do the thing you do. Play together. Play tough. Whether you're on the bench, off the bench, whatever. I want to hear positivity, up and at it. Someone goes off the game, everybody's up. Coach? Yep, guys, the big thing, play with confidence and play with decisiveness, right? If you are indecisive, if you're hesitant, if you're afraid to make a mistake, that's when the mistakes happen, right? Be confident, be decisive. Come with energy, come with passion, come with love, and let's go get it. Protect this home court. Let's go. So we go upstairs when, if this game ever ends, okay? Right in, coaches will be ready. We're gonna get into our PC warm up. We'll do that first. We'll talk quick, layup line, driving kicks, and go get a dub. Let's go. Inspect yeah. room, please. Wave room, girls locker room. Yes, depending on where we're at. I mean, hopefully the stretch is five minutes, two and a half, two and a half, and that's it. Shout out Larry Scott. Have fun, play hard.
do it. If you have anything to talk to me about, reach all the right way. Let's go. Let's go. Good luck, guys. Thanks, Johnny. Appreciate it. Let's go. Come on. One, two, three, two, three. Let's go. Project from school, basketball, and everything. I'm like, well, we'll see what happens. Number five, Jeremiah Lennon. Good luck, kid. Good luck, buddy. A Brazil, Ethan Maddox. Ethan Maddox. Number two, Robin Cervella. Go, man. If he doesn't know, he never started before. Number three, Kenny Austin. Let's go, man. Number 11, Jenny Aponte. Go, Kenny. Number two, Robin Cervella. Let's go, baby. Just kill. Literally, just kill. Go, go mode. Everybody's gonna be watching. It's the first game of the season. We gotta break that season opener, and we gotta protect the nest. That's all it. But you gotta stay focused, play with confidence, do what coach tells us to do. Out rebounds. Just be us on the floor. Run. That's all we gotta do, and we'll win. You're good, you're good, you're good. Step in! Rebound! Oh! oh that's a soft one, man. That's a soft one. He's got it! Go get it! Let's go! Kennedy! Play with him, Kennedy! Hey, action! Let's go. Better not. Stop. Up. 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 Keep it on now. Good no one. Good no one. Switch it. Smitty stay. No way. Go, 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 go. Communicating this, guys. Our help's a little late. Okay, we, we got to make sure this guy, if he's in help, your guy's here. This is us. They're gonna run that ball screen right here. When they get to the basket, this has got to be the help. Lift it up. Get here. Good, Ethan. Good, Ethan. Good, Ethan. No way. Oh. Let's go. Come on. Go, Ken. Go, Ken. Stay on the bench. Back, right, Ken. Here, Ken. Here. Close out. Coach, what? Subs, coach. Subs, coach. Subs. Outside. Go for the kick. Yeah. Ryan is not. Controlled pace. Stay disciplined. Stay disciplined. Ethan.
Screaming at the kid right in his face, you know, taunting him basically. All right, no problem. Thanks. Play the zone, coach. to be heroes on offense. We've got plenty of time. Get good looks. you got an open three, take you got a lane, go. Especially time, in zone, right? you need five guys crashed. Yeah, all everybody, five. everybody. It's automatic, okay? Let's go. Come on. You got it. Let go. Oh, we, hold on, hold on. Let, let's let him go. Let him go. You guys got to get a drink. Get one. The man will let us out of the game. That's the question. You know what I mean? We're going man on defense. Man on defense. No, you What do we want shooting this? I mean, I DJ? DJ? Come on, Jay. Come on, Kennedy. Strong! Strong! Time out! Time out! Time out! Be ready. We're going to go offense, defense, you and DJ. So, right now? Yes, now. Lob it. Hey, can't, right. Done at him. You're good, you're good, force him there. Red, red, red. That way, all day. Great job, Pesk, great job. Stop, stop, go, go! Great job, outstanding, great job. Go, go. Good job. Hold on. DJ. Go, 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 go. Pick up, full, 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 even on a miss. Violation. Top! Bail him out! Go! Shot. That's good. Hit one. Good, Smitty. Good. Good. Good job. Knock him down. Because you got three shots. So when he gets a ball on the third one, you'll go and you'll get. Uh, you're going to get. Smitty, yeah. Hey, keep playing. Hey, Jamie and Kenny, we got to go get it. Three shots. Don't violate. Three shots. Push it. On the push it, you're back. You want the ball? 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 Time out, time out. Ask him under 11, Jamie Aponte. Let's deal on a foul, what we're going to do? Yes, for? yes. Oh. No foul, no foul, no foul, no foul. 
probably killed you. Yeah. Okay. Um, if tonight wasn't your night, then we move on to the next one. That's all you can do. Capitalize on the opportunities. And sometimes, guys, I'm going to be honest with you, every game usually does not go the way you think it's going to. We can talk for days about how we think guys are going to play and how we're going to rotate guys, and then the game happens. Then there's foul trouble. Then there's guys who stepped up. Let me tell you something. Where is he? Pesky. Phenomenal. Dante was phenomenal. <laughs> Dante earned more minutes than I had originally planned for him tonight because he did the little things. He played phenomenal defense. He took his charge. He took the ball hard to the rim. Okay? He might stick next Tuesday. And we got to go to somebody else. That's how the process works. We didn't shoot the ball very well. Our shooters did not hit. The, we had four threes. Probably took a bazillion of them. Okay? Some guys were off. Didn't hit our shots. Guys, our guard play was not good. Guard play was not good enough to beat that team, okay? It's, a, it's an issue that we need to make sure that we work together and figure out how we're going to do it. I don't even mean defensively, but too many turnovers from all of our guards. We've got to be better. Here's the fact of the matter. We have one returning starter from last year. They have four on a championship team, okay? I do think we're better than them, and I think if we played them in a state tournament three months from now, I feel very confident in what we can do. Okay, but we have a lot of moving parts. Every single person on this team, even Jay, is in a different role than you were last year. Some of you are, are going times 10 when it comes to what we're asking you from what last year. It's not gonna happen, that's why I play this game. That's one of the best teams we're gonna play all season, I promise you that. That's why we do this, that's why I love playing them. Okay, because it gets us ready to go for big moments right off the rip, and guess what, it don't matter. We're still 0-0. That doesn't stop us from going to the D2 playoffs or the state tournament. It's, it's, a, it's a modified scrimmage with jerseys and people, okay? But the lights are on now at Hope High School on Tuesday night, all right? Again, a lot of good things that I saw, but it is what it is. We're 0-1. We move forward, and, uh, and, and the, the, the real stuff starts against Hope High School on Tuesday, all right? Um, we just talked upstairs, and every quarter was within two or three points. Yeah. All four quarters were within two yeah. or three. Either, either way, they won three of them, I think. So, I mean, obviously, that's a, a turnover here, a turnover there, a bucket here, a bucket there. Very close. And like Coach said, that's a very good team. That's a top five or six Division II team, no question, if they were in the division. Okay? No excuses, because I think we're better than them. Absolutely. We should have beat them, and I think if we ever see them again, we will. And we're going to have, you know, keep growing through the season. But learn from this. That's all you can do from this, right? We can't go back. We're never going to play them again, right? Learn from it, move on, and big games are coming up. We've got to get those. All right? Let's go. We well, get good. better by making practice more competitive. Let's, Absolutely. Go, right? Let's go. Together, on three. One, two, three, together. My name's Dante. I'm a senior guard here at Cranston West Basketball. This year, I think we could be a pretty good team, but I'm, I, my thing this year is that we have to take it game by game because if we worry too much about the future, we're going to get lost in the present. And also, as an individual player, take it game by game because you're not going to have those nights where you're, you're going off every single time. You can have rough nights, you can have good nights. So you just gotta play game by game and live in the present. Guys, welcome to Cranston West Basketball Media Day. We have two of our friends, Rob Santos. What are you doing? Both alumni of Cranston West. We both graduated together. They have all this wonderful equipment to get some pictures, team videos, hype videos, everything for our program. It's through our fundraising that we allow. We can do it for all three of our programs. But obviously, you see really nice new uniforms that we have. It's an amazing day, one of the, our favorite parts of the entire season to showcase our athletes. So welcome to Cranston West Media Day. <laughs> oh yeah, baby. Where's the other 15? Let's go! <laughs> 10 reps. <laughs> yeah, buddy! A free media day pump. Oh, I can't do that much weight. I'm, I'm literally just doing curls. Oh. How are you doing? Oh, why am I this, I didn't watch it from you. This is so <gasps> <laughs> no, my arms are dead. My arms are dead. Ah! Yes, sir. Yes, sir. One, two, three. It's I'm going to take my picture like this. So I look. Good, you're good there. 
You're good there. You can switch from the side. Guys, let's keep tips of toes on the half line so we're all in a perfectly straight line. Tips of toes, baby. Three, two, one. Perfect, guys. Good? Yep. What's up, Larry? <laughs> oh my god, it's gotta be the beginning of the vlog. <laughs> Yeah. Go. He says, hi Larry! <laughs> Get a load of this guy right here. What's going on? How are we doing? <laughs> right. Everyone tired, bro. How's your, how's your tire, bro? He popped his tire for practice today. He popped his tire this morning on the way to practice, bro. Crazy, man. Hell yeah. Crazy. He was late. Hell yeah, bro. Yeah, you sold me the other night. Yo, why is the ugliest kid holding the basketball? That was the biggest smile I've ever seen. Look at Jack. Timmy got a low cut. I love you, I love you. Hit me. Like they got bad. No, 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 no we're gonna get the white backdrop going and we're gonna do some pure white backdrop stuff like you know the NBA guys doing everything and then we're gonna have some fun. Spin you can do a backflip, spin the uh, spin the ball in your hand, throw it up, you know, crossover, whatever it is. We did it last year a little bit, but we're gonna do it more on the backdrop stuff. Um, and then after that we're gonna go downstairs, we're gonna shoot something in the locker room as well. Um, which would be cool for the intro for the, the hype video. Um, and then I think that's it. Yeah, that's good. Larry, don't tell me you was recording me yapping, bro. Yeah, right. so what don't tell me you I, don't, I like that. No, don't that you cut it out. You did cut it out. I, I like it. Wait. Right now, I'm, about to make myself, I'm about to make my name Noah Jermaine. Noah Jermaine! How do you buy it? How do you buy it? Oh, my God! That gel! That gel! Boy, ears, <laughs> <big as> shit. <laughs> so, you seen Johnson beat us out? You seen Johnson beat us out, bro? Bro, yes, they beat us out. They had, bro, they had nobody. I heard. When did they play? That's the some old shit. Yo, Jay, look at Cam. Elliot. Just told Jay, me Cam Elliot's. is on the Johnson team. They beat us out without Cam and Ari. I already did. When? Bro, they just scrimmaged them. They have a game later today. Bro, not today, bro. They have a game today. They beat them the other day. When? Most of them, most of them are from you. Yo, you, if you didn't pass me that ball, because you weren't, you didn't know I was out. I didn't. I until see you looked you up. I said, "Lie." No, I, even when I looked up, I, I couldn't see you because there was a kid in front of me uh, like, where you, you were. Bang on uh, that kid. Yo, yo, a Adrian said it wasn't. The kid went right under me. I went out yeah. midair. Nah, he didn't. Really you dunked on him. He didn't. Really he dunked on him. No, he didn't affect it. But I still said it's, it looked cool. Bro. It did look cool. Yeah, that was that three. <laughs> There, there. You, just like, you have to look at the camera. Man. I know, that's like hard. Nah, you gotta, I think you gotta press fast. If it drops, bro, I'll take it. I'm not gonna drop it. Alright, we're gonna get you. Hey, that looks good. Nah, that was tough. Oh my god. Yeah. Yeah, it showed us what you just did. Oh, that was good. Oh, that was good. Shake those drinks. Finesse, finesse, yup. Now go into it, spin. Good. Ball back and forth, throw it, throw it. Yup, yup, yup. Nice, nice. Cool. Now, do the slam. One more, one more, one more. One more. Yup. Maybe flex on him. Do that, go. Throw it the pirate out. Elijah was. Jay, the camera, perfect. Ball up, oh, ball up. Yeah. 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 Steve, take a step forward and go backwards. Oh, 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 Boom. Alright, oh, that's tough! Alright, alright. 
That's how it is every year though. We always get slept on and then we showed out. We did better than most of the years we got to the playoffs but got lost in the first round. So this year we got to lock in and get farther. I feel like over the summer this group got really close to each other and I feel like because of that we were able to play really well in summer league and Coach Sweeney, like all the stuff he's done for us, he sacrificed for us. It's been amazing. Like the New Jerseys, the team breakfasts, it's been great. I feel like we can do really well this year. I feel like we're one of the top teams in Division Two. I feel like we're very capable of making a deep playoff run deeper than last year. And uh, for me, it's just like contribute to that, whatever I can, just play my role. Culture from West Basketball has really showed me that they're all about family. Like, they're always together and, you know, picking each other up when times are rough. And, um, yeah, I really like the culture over there. I feel like it's like, you know, I really fit in. They really welcome me to their family. And uh, not only Coach Sweeney, but all the coaching staff and also my teammates have also, you know, been a big part of that, of me coming in. You know, random guy really welcoming me into their family. So I appreciate it. You know what I'm saying, you just got done watching episode two. We'll be back, baby! Ah!